crowned heads. Um, how do you say this? Spofa C major. That what was it? Spofa Mono. Sounds like a guy that uh, lives in Queens. Hey, Donnie Spofa Mono. Uh, interesting rapper. It is a Ecuadorian Connecticut, but it's a hybrid. Hybrid of what? I don't know. Got some loose tobacco there. Um, cap, pretty clean on that side. A little sloppy on that side, but still better than Patron 26, <laughs> right? And this is around $11, $12, what I've seen on the internet. Uh, the original price came out about two years ago. The foot smells nice. Um, it's Ecuadorian Sumatra binder and then Dominican, Nicaragua, and, and Peruvian. It's the same factory from the one I reviewed last night, which this is, last night was cigar was Luciano at the Pachardo factory, contract cigar, I guess. And this one is uh, Crown Heads. Uh, in this case, Crown Heads, uh, what didn't know, you know, choose many different companies. But in this case, Crown Heads, uh, they use the Pachardo factory too. So I'm excited to review this and um, hopefully it's good. To the person that sent me this, you know who you are. Much appreciation. Well, got into this. It's a nice, nice medium strength cigar. Uh, maybe 55% darkness. Not really a dark cigar though. Well, the finish is lingering already, which is kind of nice. Uh, it has a, like a citrus like a bright citrus note kind of nice um some black pepper um it is uh, connecticut ecuadorian but it's a hybrid uh oh no the cigar has it's definitely not uh okay it's definitely connecticut obviously whether it's gross you have ecuadorian you have nicaragua connecticut Honduran, connecticut or actual connecticut connecticut the point is it has that kind of vibe uh, as far as the lightness but as far as the actual profile uh, it's definitely unique. It doesn't fall into the classical type Connecticut uh, words. You've had this before. You know, bright cedar, like a light citrus note, black pepper, but um, it's, 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 a fun, it's a fun cigar. And just like the cigar yesterday by uh, Luciano, same factory. Well, these cigars are kind of semi-unique and they're fun. Like, it's it's a good blend. It's, it's like a lively, happy cigar that, uh, if it was an alcohol, it would remind me of champagne. A good spirit. Not trying to get your shit faced, but you're going to have a good time. And uh, it's fun and celebratory. Um, I can recommend this cigar. This Suff Mono in C Major. Um... This is about a Churchill size and uh, enjoyable and more interesting than a classic Connecticut. So uh, definitely a, a wise choice in the blend. Uh, choosing all different types of tobaccos, fermentations to get to the end result. Okay, deep into this, um, staying around a medium strength cigar, 55% darkness, really not a dark cigar. Um, oh, I burnt my finger here. Just be careful. Um, I enjoyed it. Uh, it wasn't as good as the Luciano cigar yesterday. Um, and I think it's going to be a 4.3. I think it's an enjoyable cigar. I think this blender would fall under, like, you know, good to very good, uh, but not a solid very good. I, I think it. It's definitely enjoyable. It's definitely a good cigar, uh, but it, you know, after smoke, smoking it through, um, and it was, it was kind of unique for a Connecticut shade. But um, I don't know. What's my feeling on this? I can recommend it as far as being a good cigar. Good to very good, but uh, somewhere in between there, 4.3. I liked it. Um, I probably wouldn't, if I saw it at a store, I probably wouldn't go and buy it again, though. Um, not every cigar, look, the hope is when you smoke a cigar, it's gonna be at least good, and it's definitely good. It's definitely more than good, but it's not more than very good, so it's 
it's good to very good, 4.3. Um, maybe worth trying once, if you like Connecticut, but uh, there's a lot of other Connecticut's, for example, like the Romeo, the yellow band, in Nicaragua, Connecticut, that will come in a cheaper price that I think is a better cigar. Um, and that has really enjoyable flavors. Um, so it's still a solid stick. I mean, if a cigar is good, it, you know, from there, you know, we, we look to see, you know. The, the, but, uh, yeah, so it, it's it was a good cigar. 4.3. Good construction. But uh, overall, um, I'm glad I tried it. But as far as my recommendation... You could definitely enjoy it, and it's, I think it's definitely a good cigar, and there's nothing wrong with something being just good, you know, uh, but don't get ex expectations to be this being great or, or really very good. Um, the Around the same price that Luciano cigar I smoked yesterday was a superior cigar to this from the same factory. So it is what it is. Size of the blend, <laughs> and the blend is the cigar. I'll see you guys around. Stay fresh.